and you don't know who this is, this is Particular Nova, and here is another episode of Zombies. Yay! Anyways, this is another late commentary. 4 a.m. in the morning. 4.08, actually, to be precise. And here is another Ascension Run to 50. Road to 50. Woo! Not like I haven't been to round 50 before in Ascension. I'm pretty sure you guys seen it in my previous video. Um, anyways, talk about this. I was gonna play maybe around 60 on this game, 80. Then again, my excuses. My sister kicked me off. I know. She can be total mean sometimes. And it, it just irritates me. It's, it's We both paid for the Xbox. We split half of the time. And at first, I was one who was addicted to the Xbox. Going on, it constantly playing zombies because I'll be honest with you. Um, back then, I used to be like a leaderboard person who, who want like not a leaderboard person but a person who wants to be really high on the leaderboards and um, I can't really go past to I can't really pass any level by like 45 or something because my connection would lag out or the host or on top of it um what was it again uh I'm to remember what it was but anyways so I was having fun with the dolls. I did go down once on this map. Um, the weird thing was though that, uh, okay, get this. This this was funny. This is the weird thing that I'm talking about right now. I was playing offline and I didn't know that there's no mule kick when you're offline because you only get mule kick when you sign in the profile, which I find is really cool, but at the same time, really stupid. Okay, don't get, like, Mule Kick, I'll, I'll tell you this, Mule Kick is a nice perk only when you have, like, um, those special Wonder Weapons. Like, Wonder Weapons are uses like, the VR-11, for example, um, because, let's say if you're in co-op and you're with another player, the VR-11 always takes one slot from your hand, from your gun perk, guns, why did I say perk, but from your guns, and from there, um, you, you'd be stuck with like one one gun and one wonder weapon that has no really good use for yourself. That's what I'm talking about the VR11. So the fact that Mule Kick is in Call of the Dead is what I like. The fact that it's in Kino, Ascension, um, what else is there? The classic maps. Those I don't I don't like it because really there's no use to it when you're going into a far round, including in solo. There's there's been like, so many people asking others whenever they'll play solo in high rounds to get mule kick every time because they think that it's going to be so good to kill the zombies. But you have to understand that once you reach at, like, a certain round, like 50, for instance, mule kick is not going to be a good use. It's not good use at all. And it's something you want to avoid after a certain round. From the, for the beginning of the rounds, yes, it'd be useful because you'll be getting a lot more points. But... Other than that, the only thing I find useful about Mule Kick is only for one of the weapons like the VR-11 or uh, Call, well, Call of Duty has a VR-11 and the Scavenger or something. Because the Scavenger at a certain round isn't very good at a point. So if you were playing co-op and it was just two players, that person can always hold on to the VR-11 and the Scavenger because with the VR-11 you get, you split up the points so you guys both get the amount of, same amount of points and it's shared, you know. As for the scavenger, it can be really useful. Um, actually, the other player would have to have the scavenger because they're the ones who can shot with. But other than that, it's not a really useful perk, you could say. And in the video, you just see me throwing those Vushka dolls. Where I can't pronounce them right, so I'm going to call them Vushka dolls. I don't know why I'm saying Vushka dolls. They're probably not even pronounced that way or anything. Correct me if I'm wrong, but... Those things, at first, I never liked them, I'll be honest with you. I, I never liked it because the moment you throw them on the ground, it would no spread all over the place and I would always miss the zombies. I'm like, why am I missing the zombies, you know? This is really stupid. So, after a while, a friend of mine told me, like, instead of shoot, like throwing it at them, kind of throw it to the ground in front of you and back away because if you don't have a um, PhD flopper, you would get really damaged. Um, what's so cool about them is that it's instant kill. That's a really cool thing. Um, other than that, you know, uh, here I'm just collecting uh, ammo for the MP5K. I didn't even bother to upgrade the Thunder Gun because 
it was really pointless. I didn't need ammo, like, not ammo, but I didn't need extra ammo from the Thunder Gun because I was doing so well because I've been using more uh, fire traps in this game than I was using the Thunder Gun. The only time I use the Thunder Gun is if, like, uh, either the traps haven't been, like, uh, charged or uh, I just want to get it out of the way. And the running spot that I'm in here, it takes a while for the zombies to spawn to come to you. And, like, some other spots. Um, there are other spots where the landers are that become really faster because of the more windows that are around you. Here, there's only like two windows. There's one from up the stairs and one to the PhD flopper. And they don't mostly go through there. They mostly go through down the stairs. And you can tell that they all come from where the stamina up is. And um, near the pack-a-punch room. But other than that, it was um, pretty... Uh, it was a fun game, I'll tell you. It took about a half hour to not a half hour, two hours at least. I mean, if you keep... Uh, I started using the traps when I was around 45, you could say. Uh, about 40 to 45, if I can remember. But um, after that level, you just want to start using the traps so you can just, you know, get the waves out faster because at that point, when you reach 40, it takes a lot longer to shoot zombies. I mean... That's where some people think that mule kick can be really handy because you have more ammunition. But the thing is, with mule kick, it kind of—I don't find it useful for other guns to hold except the wonder weapons. The wonder weapons, like the VR11, for instance, and uh, thunder gun, um, the baby maker. I—I I, I can't pronounce the baby maker of it, but um, they're—it's uh, very useful, you know. Um, there's the wonder waffle. One waffle you can only use in um called not in Call of the Dead in the classic maps as well, but um in Call of the Dead you can't really switch perks and also it's kinda like pointless in a way if you're gonna keep killing George and solo. Um the only thing I can think of a good way for um Mule Kick to be useful in Call of the Dead solo is for that VR eleven for George and the scavenger is good until at some point in the round, but you can't shoot yourself with the VR11. That's the sad part. I wish there were you can, like, bounce it on yourself, like you do with the ray gun where it sprays. I don't know why I said bounce, but I'm pretty sure you guys get the picture of it. But um, it, it's it's pretty cool. I mean, here I'm just trying out um, a little run in this room. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys seen the videos from Middle Master. Uh, he's been showing a demonstration in this room how to do a rate training with the thunder gun and stuff at level 100 and when I was counting how many times he used the thunder gun in that room it was about 25 times so I thought like oh level 100 25 times a wave but I guess I'm wrong because it changes every once in a while you could say um there's 24 that spawn and there is about 25 30 waves after so many rounds and then it would keep going i guess it depends where you are as well i'm not sure it also depends i guess if you use a wonder weapon often or if you use traps who knows but about an average of 600 zombies if you're that you will kill uh per round 600 to a thousand zombies it all depends if that's in solo but if you're in co-op it can be anywhere from 600 to thousand or two thousand or you can even get a whole bunch in like one round because you're killing your teammates waves or see like there I got stuck so I was like oh shit but other than that it was pretty fun this map really fun to do commentating commentating oh wait I didn't sneeze ah I don't want to sneeze but um other than that people ask me quite like people keep asking me to do, do a commentary with them and I'll tell you this now I, I wouldn't mind honestly but First, I wanted to do a commentary with people who I know and friends. Uh, it, it, like, someday I will get to it. If anything, um, chances are when you'll ever get to do a commentary with me or play a game with me is when I receive my new computer and start live streaming because that's one of the main things I really love doing. Um, uh, like I said in my previous video, I like doing live stream. I used to do live streaming for my art, but my Mac can't handle it anymore, so I can't live stream. Um, I tried live streaming before, but it failed. Other than that, um, I, I am gonna live stream and have you people play with me if you want, or see me uh, play solo attempts. You know, 
uh, give me challenges or something, but most of the times on live stream when I'm on there, I'm probably going to be doing high levels. I will be uploading more videos soon, but it takes a while. Right now, it's just really intense at the moment. Um, I'm pretty sure you guys all heard on my previous video of uh, my dog's pup who didn't make it when she gave birth to it, which is a natural thing when it happens to first litters. Um, I had a, I have another dog that had like seven litters, so uh, it, it's sad, you know, it hurt my dog, like it hurt my feelings to see my dog be uh, worried where her pup is when and such, and it was a bummer, but other than that, you know, eventually if she has another litter again, she'll be more prepared this time, and uh, by then, uh, Everything will be alright. As for my other dog that has cancer, he's doing a lot better actually, to be honest. Um, he's been doing really good, which I'm really impressed with. I don't remember what's the medication he's taking, but uh, the medication lasts for about two weeks that he has. And, uh, other than that, you can see me, I'm having troubles getting out of this place. Um, if I try to remember, oh yeah. So anyways, other to that, like anything other to that, live streaming I will be doing very often. I mean, I'll try the best I can to play with everybody who wants to play with me. Um, also, as I'm looking right now on my computer here, um, thank you so much for the 2,000 subscribers. Right now I'm at, uh, let me refresh my page here, my computer is really slow. My computer is really slow. Oh. And you can hear my own thing. And thank you so much for the 2,243 subscribers. It means a lot to me. Um, I kind of like woke up to it, you know. I've been staying up late a lot. I've been playing custom maps. I'm having people come. I'm having uh, my cousin and her baby along with her father come down for three weeks. And I just can't wait. They're coming within like four days. The day of the release of Modern Warfare 3. I am so stoked about it. I'm happy. Oh, this is where I got stuck and I was like, shit. Anyways, I was super happy. Uh, nah, I was super happy. I am happy and excited, you know, having to have somebody come down. Um, other than that, you have know, watched me approach this whole place. This is awesome. Be like, oh shit. I'm surprised I didn't die there. I was like, I thought for sure I was gonna be dead, but. Um, so yeah, I might not be able to upload videos as much for the three weeks in time, but by then I should have my computer, so maybe the only time I can actually do something for you guys is to stream, if anything, because streaming is a lot different than making videos and rendering. I don't know. I might make a video, but I'm not sure. I mean, I'm going to be spending time with my cousin and her baby as much as possible because they don't come every year or anything. They normally come down where they are every year. I'm not saying where because, you know, it's not right, but here we go. I killed myself anyways. Do enjoy the video. Um, please like, favorite, subscribe, and uh, give me challenges of what you want to see on my channel. I'll try the best I can. Please leave a comment below, and uh, yeah, hope you like the video. Nova over and out.